everyone, welcome back or welcome to my channel. In today's video, I'm doing an original piece of art. The name is Self-Preservation and basically it's just an anatomical human heart inside of an apothecary bottle filled with some fluid and then there's a banner across it that just says Self-Preservation. The purpose behind this piece was to convey the idea that you're locking your heart away so that nobody else can get it and you're preserving your life and yourself, I guess, is kind of what I wanted it to be, but hopefully that message kind of comes across. You can interpret it in any way you'd like, actually, but that was my interpretation for the piece. I started this piece off by sketching out a human heart, and then I went in and lined it up with the bottle shape that I wanted in order to get the sizing correct, and then went in with some color. Now, I do have my reference pictures available to see uh, during the drawing process and I will link those down below in the description if anybody wants to use the same ones that I used and I wanted them really just so that I could get the right colors so that they weren't all wonky and didn't look right with each other. I had a lot of fun making this piece because I was using a lot of different brushes that I've never used before and it was creating a lot of cool texture which I really wanted and of course I love drawing human anatomy in particular organs because I just think that they're so cool. This isn't the first time I've drawn a human heart and it's probably not going to be the last time. I've actually debated getting a tattoo of a heart somewhere on my body but haven't gone through with that one yet. So once I was finished with the heart I moved on to the bottle. I shortened the neck from the one that was in the reference picture because I wanted everything to be a little bit more compact. And then I just went ahead with a bunch of blenders and airbrush in order to create that glass look. Then I moved into the cork using the same technique as the heart in order to give it a whole bunch of texture. I hope that that texture comes across in the final image. You might have to zoom in to see it uh, on my Instagram. So maybe people will see it, maybe not, but I know it's there and that's what matters. So after I was done coloring all of it, I needed to add the liquid. Originally, I wasn't going to put anything in the jar with the heart, but I decided that it would be better if it looked as if it was preserved. The actual preservative used in the hospital is formalin and it's clear, but I wanted to add a little bit more color to kind of balance out that red, so I decided to make mine kind of a tinge of green as if it was like a horror movie, but it's not. <laughs> so I added the fluid. I tried to give it some bubbles, but it didn't really work the way that I wanted it to. So I gave up on that and just left it as clear fluid. And here I am now working on the banner that goes across it. I decided to use the same colors that were in the cork of the bottle in order to make it more cohesive. And then I just went and did some of my own handwriting in there. I didn't bother trying to find a font or anything because I knew that was going to be far too much work for me. So afterwards, we're just gonna put all of the pieces together. I am really happy with the way that the shape of the banner ended up working with the bottle. I wasn't planning for them to work together so well, but the fact that they did just makes me really happy. And then I spent a really long time trying to find a background color. Um, but anyways, this is the final piece. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure to leave a like, comment down below, subscribe to my channel. I post new videos every Monday afternoon and I will see you all next week.